We're at a gas station on the corner of 47th and Mission Road, but we're not here to fill up on gas. We're here to fill up on what is said to be the best barbecue on the planet, Oklahoma Joe's. This place is awesome, man. Welcome, John. It's nice to have you here. Thank Lines you so every much. Day, huh? uh, every day, every day out the door, at least once a day, usually twice a day. So what makes this place so special? Well, you know, when our owners, uh, Jeff and Joy Staney, founded this place in uh, 1996, they had been competing in barbecue contests for several years leading up to that time. And they'd been winning those contests. They had a relationship with this uh, with the, the guy who owned and operated the gas station here. So they bought their bought the corner, they kept the convenience store, the gas station, because hey, you know, it, Why not? it, it makes money. Absolutely. And so it's now part of the business model for this place, part of our identity now. I'd love to see the smoker, the back room. I want to check this place out. That's where the magic happens. Let's go check okay. it out. David here is preparing our uh, spare ribs for uh, rubbing, and then we'll put them in the smokehouse. Look pretty good, don't oh, they? Oh, yeah. <laughs> smell, smell good, too, don't they? Yeah, they smell incredible. Barbecue, at least Kansas City style and, and Texas style and in the Carolinas, it's low temperature, uh, indirect heat. And uh, over a long period of time at low temperatures, that fat will render out uh, without losing your tenderness. Uh, you get a lot of penetration of smoke and a lot of absorption of the seasonings into the meat over that long period of time. All right, this is our kitchen uh, and our fry stations, the French fries, onion rings. It's also where we do a, a lot of our uh, uh, trimming of our brisket and that type of thing. That's what Vidal's getting ready to do right now. Isn't that nice? Woo! Look how moist that is. Uh, yeah. Yum. This is our to-go station. We've already asked them to stay in the line for a long time. Yeah. It's not a science, it's an art. And, uh, you know, but uh, it, works, it works pretty well. Got your ribs, you saw them being made, right? And then we've got the pulled pork, you saw that as well. Got our brisket, also slow smoked for about 17 hours on Missouri White Oak, which is what we use to smoke our meats, and then our homemade, uh, our house-made sausage. This is our food that we're making for you, not somebody else's food that we're serving to you. You know what I notice in here too, Doug, is everybody is different. There's such a cross-section of America in this oh, place. Oh yeah, absolutely. It's the most uh, democratic and egalitarian uh, of all foods. You know, we've got uh, just an entire cross-section of American life right here in our dining room every day. This is the best barbecue I have ever had in Thank my you, life. man. Thank you. Know, you. Anthony Bourdain says this is one of the top 13 places to eat before you die. I say it's in your top five. Definitely got to check out Oklahoma Joe's in Kansas City.